Hello potatoes and welcome back to another video on my channel. I'm going to say right from the start, I'm sorry about the little logo in the corner. I couldn't find a, a decent uh, video speeding up um, without having a logo in the corner. But anyway, so let's get straight into this. This is going to be where I build stuff and I'm basically going to talk you through it. So I'm adding these, li I added the little posts on just to add some detail into it. And I've gone up now to the second floor so I can get an idea of what I want it to look like. Um, I decided to go for the three windows I thought it added more detail and is better and I've decided to go for the high door so that um, it matches with the windows better um, I've decided to put foundations in as well just because I feel like that adds more um, decoration to it also and I'm having trouble using the pillars so earlier on you saw me use a cheat and it was bb.move objects I talk about this a lot on my channel especially in the building conservatory it's pretty and much a necessity so I decided, uh, after I'd done all my windows, I was going to try and do a balcony. Now, I'm always having trouble using balconies, and I thought it was too close, so I moved it back, like just you saw. And um, I decided to miss, um, mess around with some fence types. None of the gates, annoyingly, matched the fence. <coughs> Sorry. And then I tried to go for a more modern theme. However, I thought that this was going to be a more of a traditional house, um, <coughs> except from the windows, which are quite modern which I did change later. Now, I then decided that um, upstairs um, didn't really seem that amazing, but I'll get to that in a minute. And I decided to work on the roof just because it was annoying me seeing the um, blank roof. So I've never really been that good at roofs, roofing, but I dabbled around and I pulled some bits in and personally I think that's probably a, quite a nice looking roof. Um, and I decided to go for more of a black. Now, this is what I was talking about. I decided to maybe change it up to black fencing, black gate, black rails. However, I thought that it just didn't match the nice light theme of the house. So I changed it all back using the design tool. However, you couldn't use it on fences. So I had to use it, uh, just re-go over it all. Um, and then I decided to add a conservatory, which if you haven't seen my How to Build a Conservatory video, I'll leave a link in the description below. Now, I spent quite a bit of time working on this I decided that I was going to do a small conservatory with one triangle roof on top however when it actually got down to it I had to make it um, a little bit um, bigger or actually I made the house smaller and I decided that it looked good and it looked nice however I thought it was very small so I decided to double it add some more of the um, the little glass roofs in and I actually ended up really liking it and I added in the windows that I should have I accidentally, well, I did. I deleted that wall on purpose. However, in a minute you'll see that I actually need to rebuild that wall to make the foundations on the uh, conservatory different. <coughs> I tried adding a little bit of a wall outside, but the best way to do it is add it inside, and I made it kind of like this little thing. But then I decided to keep it all the same anyway, as um, I'm not really sure I like that crisscross wooden thing. Um, and then I decided to add in some windows. Now I decided that. Um, the well I'd finally realized that I'd made a shape an odd the house an odd shape so I had to try and change up the windows I was quite happy with it not my ideal windows and then I added windows into the roof roofing triangles and they just didn't line up and it was really getting on my nerves so I was just trying around and in the end I thought the little triangles don't actually need um, the little windows and I've added in a going round thing it goes around the greenhouse as well however I think I like it and I've now done some, I'm now doing some just decorations, like the plants. I decided that if I wanted a more clean cut hedge, um, I could do this. And then I realised that with BB Move objects, I can fill in all the gaps. And I thought it created a nice clean thing. And I decided to um, then try and fit windows at the front. And I put that one at the front. However, then I decided to delete them, two ones, like I said. I then added in two elephants and some of the little ball trees. And um, I was trying, just looked a bit bare, so I tried picking some flowers, and that also looked really nice. I put some benches down on the thing. I tried to dabble around with some different tables, however, I thought that um, adding in a nice bench with a barbecue on top, as the garden isn't that big on this place. Um, so then I then added the mailbox, and I decided to use some custom content on making it look a little bit more detailed. We don't have a very big garden, but I made a, just a little bit of decorations, a little bit of the pool. I know those two plant pots aren't in line, but um, I did change it after the video. I added some windows. I could build a basement, but I thought this looked good as it was. So I then named it Modern House Two Stories. 
and it will now be on the gallery so go ahead and download it if you like it anyway if you've liked this video please make sure you leave it a like and subscribe and i'll see you in the next one bye